to begin the day with aircraft lining up for takeoff. Hi, I'm Stephen Thomas. Join us as me and my crew are going to take you on a journey around National Flying Training Institute. So let us begin. Welcome to Bishri Airport, where as you can see, flying training is at its peak. And as a child, we've all seen aircraft and gotten excited. Most of us have dreamt of flying and some of us have chosen it as a career. It is a serious and challenging profession. It teaches and cultivates certain values and qualities required for a pilot. Now remember, we're talking about becoming a pilot, not just a license holder. But don't take my word for it. Let's ask some of the pilots here at our school what they've learned through flying. Let's see what they have to say. Abhi, Abhi, what have we learned from flying? Flying. Yeah. I've learned uh, to be patient and uh, punctual. Flying has demanded me to take better care of myself by staying fit and getting over my bad habits. I always had this fear of heights, but flying has helped me overcome it. Respect is what I have learned in this profession. I've learned to take responsibilities in my life. And of course, Grooming. To be confident and to know our own limitations. Flying? <laughs> Nothing much. I started waking up early in the morning. That's it. Mistakes today, are lessons tomorrow. Position. Camera. Self confidence. Multitasking. Professionalism. The right attitude. On time performance. Drop it up! Drop it up! Those were some great replies, some funny ones too. But on a serious note, if you want to gather these qualities, you need to have an established institute. Now I'm lucky enough to say that I gathered it from CAE's National Flying Training Institute along with the Airports Authority of India. And here are where the cadets or trainees, right from their selection, ground school to the completion of 200 hours of flying, are molded to have skills, judgment and impeccable knowledge to be at par with the airline pilots of today. So we are guided by our esteemed instructors. Let's take a look at what they have to say. Okay, so it goes like this, students come to our flight school and uh, before they join us they have to uh, have certain percentage in 10 plus 2 and they have to undergo a CAS selection process that is CAE air crew selection process. Once you are selected, you get inducted, we have extensive ground school, you stay in ground school for a couple of months, 
once you learn how to what are the forces and uh, some theory about flying you are sent to flight school once you come to flight school you can see all around we have so many airplanes over here and uh, we also have a very good maintenance team which is very efficient and we all work under a very good safety management system so safety is our priority which you can see over here and we have about 12 airplanes uh, 12 single engines and two multi-engine airplanes this one is a multi-engine airplane and uh, if you want to fly this is the best place you just come we have got airplanes we have got perfect instructors very very professional instructors and the environment is uh, pretty professional yeah now we have in our school every year cadets graduating to join the airlines of today we have such a person captain joshua on his way to join indigo airlines Welcome Captain Joshua. How are you? I'm good Stephen. How are you? I'm good. Captain Joshua, let me first congratulate you on completing your CPL. Thank you so much. And on the successful moment of yours, would you like to share some of your experiences here at NFTI with us? Well, first of all, it's been a great privilege being a part of NFTI. In my opinion, this is one of the best flight training institutes in India. Now, to talk about piloting as a profession, unlike most of the courses where it's more of theory and less of practical, being a pilot requires more than just bookish knowledge. The process involves gaining knowledge, and applying it through every aspect of our flight. I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. Absolutely. Thereby, it's imperative that we not be mechanical pilots, but we be pilots who can see what the situation demands of us, adapt ourselves, and, and react accordingly. And that's what we tend to do at NFT. And yeah, I'd also like to take this opportunity to thank everyone who's been a part of me through my training. First of all, I'd like to thank God Almighty, my instructors, my friends, my family, the entire NFT management and staff, but without their help and support, I wouldn't be where I am today. And yes. That feels great. Well, it should feel great and all the best to you in the future. Thank you so much. Alright. That was Captain Joshua signing off and as for me, where to next Prabhakran? Airport. Airport. Let's go. So I know you're ready to grab the controls and start flying. If you think you have what it takes to become a pilot, come fly with us. For those of you who are still confused, here's a message for you. Don't miss flying at NFTI. So don't miss flying at NFTI. Thank you for joining us. Have a good day. Respect the air, respect the aircraft. Have fun responsibly. Have fun and fly safe. Being pilot is a very disciplined job. Always remain focused, disciplined and follow your heart and enjoy flying.